I started doing this in 1982. Uh, I had some friends and they, uh, they had some older brothers that were doing this. They seemed to do quite well. I would go as a helper occasionally. And they would pay and uh, kind of got hooked. Yeah, 10-4, it's already arranged. Five, mark 5-2 on uh, 2050 June. Well, I'd have to say the number of tow trucks that are out here now. It seems like there's too many. When you go to a, an accident or a breakdown, respond to a police call, it's not uncommon to see five or six tow trucks. Everybody's got to put food on the table, I understand that. The lack of regulation has caused a, a problem in the towing industry. Hopefully it's going to be addressed. It creates a lot of competition amongst the companies. There's only so much work, and we have a large number of people looking for that work. It can create problems, certainly, and it has. It has. The greater Toronto area has been the scene of significant violence between rival tow trucks and tow industry. In response to all of this criminal activity, in February of 2020, York Regional Police partner with the Ontario Provincial Police, the Toronto Police Service, and the Canada Revenue Agency, and launched a joint force investigation dubbed Project Platinum. There's sometimes, there's quite often there's an intimidation when there's a number of trucks there. Uh, that starts to come into play. And uh, I think if you were to interview anyone uh, with EMS or Toronto Fire, they would have some stories to share, certainly. It's only made, it's made things worse when, when things flare up. And we all get painted with the same brush, you know. The tow truck, uh, all the tow truck's gonna, some people think, oh, the tow truck's gonna rip me off. Uh, or they've heard stories of other people that have had problems. So they think that uh, a lot of people, not everybody, but a lot of people think that uh, they're all, we're all the same. We're all up for a quick buck and, uh, and that's it. Is there should be some, some standardized training not just for this municipality, that municipality, but across the entire province. There has to be enforcement. If there's no enforcement, you can make all the laws in the world, but if they're not enforced, things won't change.